Hello everyone. Welcome to session 51 of security testing video series. In this session, I'm going to show you how Bob suit can increase the attack surface. So let me practically demonstrate this for you. So first launch Bob suit in your machine and go to the proxy tab, select the intercept tab and make sure this intercept option is turned off. If it is on, just turn it off guys. And click on this open browser so that the browser related to this Bob suit proxy tool will launch like this. So here browse an application like demo.testfire.net. Once you go to this application, go to the sign in page. Now here in this sign in page, that is login page. What is the attack surface guys of this login page? There are two possibilities here. From here, attacker can enter some malicious code. Here also attacker can enter some malicious code, right? Here attack surface is only two fields. Let's say I'll give the proper credentials, admin, admin. Okay. And before I click on the login button, I'll turn on this intercept. I'll on this intercept. And now, now what I will do is, after I turn on this intercept option in the burp suit, I'll click on the login button. You see, this particular request is captured in the burp suit. Here, you see whatever the details we gave in this, uh, Username field admin has come here and also password is also there in the admin is the username and admin is the password along with these two parameters. Now we have another parameter also that is submit is equal to login. We can also modify this one also now, right? Earlier, the attack surface is only this two text fields, but now in this request, the attack surface got increased guys. You can modify this. Okay. You, attacker can enter some malicious code, not only in the username, not only the password, but also this login button. Okay, this login button here, this login button is not the attack surface. But in case of this burp suit proxy tool, when this request for this particular login functionality is captured here, you see login button is also a parameter guys. Okay, the login button is also sent as a parameter here. So you can modify this and send a single quote. So here this proves the attack surface is increased. With the help of burp suit, we can increase the attack surface. Here, in case of the UI from the client application, from the UI of the client application, the attack surface is only these two text fields. You can only modify these two values from the UI. If you're testing from the UI, you can only modify these two text fields. But from the request that is captured by this burp suit tool, you can not only modify the username value or password value from this request, but also you can modify the login button also. That means the attack surface got increased from two to three. Okay, two to three. So hope guys, you understood how to increase the attack surface using Burp suit. So that's it guys. Thank you. Bye.